Prophet Muhammad وسلم, must be obeyed. The aim of this video is to demonstrate clearly that Allah orders us to accept, follow and obey the authentic hadith. This is because Allah commands us specifically to obey the Prophet وسلم, 28 times in the Quran. This video will focus on three ayat in particular that clearly establishes that obeying the Messenger وسلم, is a fundamental principle of Islam. It will also illustrate the danger of rejecting the authentic Sunnah of the Prophet وسلم. In the first ayah, Allah says, "Qul in kuntum tuhibbu Allah." Say, if you are to love Allah, fattabi'uni, then follow me. Loving Allah is part of Iman. Here Allah tells us that if we really love Allah, then we have to obey Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Then Allah says something amazing. Yuhbibkumullah. Allah will love you. وَيَغْفِرْ لَكُمْ ذُنُوبَكُمْ And forgive you your sins. وَاللَّهُ غَفُورُ rahim And Allah is most forgiving, most merciful. Thus, Allah will love us when we obey Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. He will forgive us our sins and show mercy towards us. The only way to obey Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is through the authentic hadith. Then to leave no doubt that Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam must be obeyed, Allah mentions it again for emphasis in the next ayah. Qul ati'ullaha wa rasoola Say, obey Allah and the Messenger. Fa'in tawallaw But if they turn away, fa'inna allaha La tuhibbul kafirin. Then Allah does not love the disbelievers. This ayah makes it very clear that we must obey Allah and the Messenger, and not doing so is disbelief. By using the word wa rasula, Allah makes it clear that we must obey Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam. Obeying Allah is what is in the Quran and obeying Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam is what is in the authentic hadith therefore by rejecting authentic hadith a person rejects Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam as it is only through authentic hadith that we can obey him please note that i am not talking about scholars who reject certain hadith for valid reasons according to usul al hadith I'm only speaking to those people who reject authentic hadith because it does not suit them or because they do not like what it says. Quranists argue that obeying Allah and the Messenger وسلم, means to follow only the Quran. There are three major problems with this argument. Firstly, the Arabic conjunction wa meaning and signifies that the Prophet وسلم, must be obeyed in his status as the messenger for things he commanded which are not found in the Qur'an. This is the only interpretation which makes sense linguistically, grammatically and logically. Otherwise, number two, we would have to believe that the words of the Prophet وسلم, are also in the Qur'an. Na'udhu billah. Thirdly, the verse would mean obey Allah and the Qur'an, which is again very problematic because this means Allah's commandments and the Qur'an are two separate things, which is totally absurd. Thus, when Allah commands us to obey the Messenger وسلم, we do so by accepting and obeying authentic hadith. Otherwise, by rejecting authentic hadith, we reject and disobey Rasulullah sallallahu and we disobey Allah. Furthermore, 
Ayah number three, Allah says, Man yuti'i rasul Whoever obeys the messenger, فَقَدْ أَطَاعَ Allah Does indeed obey Allah. فَمَنْ تَوَلَّى فَمَا أَرْسَلْنَاكَ عَلَيْهِمْ حَفِيظًا And those who turn away, we have not sent you as a watcher over them. Here, obedience to Rasulullah wasallam is obedience to Allah. This ayah only makes sense if the Messenger wasallam also commanded things that were not mentioned in the Qur'an. Otherwise, if the phrase obeys the Messenger refers only to the Qur'an, then this ayah would mean whoever obeys Allah does indeed obey Allah, which is redundant. This meaning does not make any logical sense. In conclusion, obeying Rasulullah is a fundamental pillar of Islam, and that is why it is the second source of the Sharia. The authentic Sunnah is the only way to obey Rasulullah Those who reject obeying Rasulullah are called disbelievers by Allah Azza wa Jalla.